Morning everybody, it's time for the Coming Out Terror Intention of the Day. If you've been here before, welcome back. If you're new here, welcome. My name's Seth. You can find out more about me by going to comingouttarot.com. Hey, special. Uh, and if you are watching this on the replay, thanks. It's going to be up for about 24 hours, so please share it with other folks. If you, uh, hey Fusion, if you haven't been here before, the Terror Intention of the Day is meant to give you an opportunity to be, hey Jen, to be thoughtful and mindful about the events that occur during the course of your day. So if you're not quite sure how to do that, I definitely recommend checking this out at the end of the day. You can find it here, or if you don't come uh, here the morning, then definitely go check it out on um, Facebook uh, or YouTube, same handle, Coming Out Tarot, and you can find it there so you can reflect back on it, uh, especially even if you want to reflect back on the week. So this is definitely not meant to be a prediction for your day, but if you check that out at the end of the day, think about the events that occurred, how you could have applied this intention in order to achieve the outcome or move in the direction of the outcome in which you'd like to go is the purpose of the intention of the day. So that's the point. Um, today I am using the Marielle Tarot, it's that shiny deck that's hard to see sometimes when I show it on here. And the card that I've drawn for today is the Wheel of Fortune. Thanks, Fusion. Uh, so what's important to me today, actually, in this card is the big sail slash crescent moon that is behind Fortune herself. Sometimes people uh, get focused so much on the Wheel of Fortune being that turning experience of our life either within or without of our control and today I think your intention in order to be successful in your day or move those events in the way in which you'd like look uh, like them to go is actually to trust your intuition and that's really kind of hard to do but trust your intuition that it's time for things to move forward now we've had a lot of intentions of the day that have happened uh, about building a structure and having that structure be prepared for other things to come and uh, having your relationships be more successful based on that structure so we've had a lot of building up until this point so I'm not surprised that we're seeing uh, a an intention for the day that is telling you you've done your work trust your intuition and let change happen now, the other side of that coin is, uh, since you've been doing all of your work, you can uh, watch that change happen with your own work continuing. So your intuition, intuition is always going to be a part of moving that forward. Uh, your uh, sense of the universe moving with you is always going to be a part of that. But you can still have control over that change because change doesn't have to be passive. So uh, you can see in here not only is that... Um, that sail slash moon behind her, something that's important to me today, she is active in uh, the participation of moving something forward. So you can be just as active. You don't have to be 100% passive in change. So that's your intention for the day. I hope it's helpful. Hey, Geneva, if it is, please let other people know about it. I've seen some of you share already. Uh, please do let other people know about it. Share it far and wide so everyone can benefit from the intention of the day. I'd love for everybody to also drop me a line and let me know no problem. Uh, you're going to have to watch it on the replay. I just got done talking about everything. Uh, but thanks for being here. I really do appreciate you finding your way in. I know it's um, early where you are. So uh, share with other people and drop me a line and let me know how the intention of the day has played out in your day. I'd love to hear about it. Some I hear great stories about how people have applied the intention and uh, and had success in their day because they've applied this intention or at least had some mild um uh, observations that they were wouldn't have otherwise been aware of so that's been cool too so let me know how it goes uh, i hope this is helpful uh, if you want to find out more about me use the link down there for coming out tarot and you can also find out more about my passion project right now which is helping other people find your passion by going to coming out tarot scrolling down a little bit there's a big button in there that says passion and go read about what i'm working on if you join my uh, contact list i'll be able to keep connected with you about this passion journey and i'm going to have more stuff for you by the end of the month so that you can hear more about what it is and figure out uh, the best way for you to get involved as i start to roll this thing out so thanks everybody I will see you all tomorrow.